On episode 173, we look at the five groups of people within U.S. soccer. Welcome to Soccer Works with Daniel Workman, where we take a look at how soccer works in the U.S. and around the world. On this episode, we are looking at the five groups of people within U.S. soccer. The first group are the ambivalent. They don't really care about the macro. They don't concern themselves with federation system structures, etc. They just go throughout their daily lives. Everyone else falls into one of four categories. Status quo, those are the ones like Major League Soccer, the leadership within U.S. soccer, who if they want any kind of change or reform, they want it to be incremental and leaning or, or, or siding with status quo. And then you have those on the other end of the spectrum. They are the activists, the reformers. They want to see the U.S. Soccer Federation be in full FIFA compliance. And they, they champion the cause of opportunity for everyone everywhere. The other two groups fall in between those two uh, opposite ends. And those are the neutrals. You have one set of neutrals that lean towards status quo. And, and you have another set of neutrals that lean towards reform. And the reason why you have these this group of neutrals is, is that the Federation itself has a culture of fear and intimidation. So they are, they are afraid to speak out because they are afraid of losing access and opportunity for themselves. We have got to get more people wrapping their heads around doing what it takes to reach our best in order for us to succeed in the future. Thanks for listening. Until next time.